and the adventure continues across Nebraska. Oh, well, good morning, guys. Yeah, um, decided to relocate today because where I'm camped out, I was camped out, my tent was right here. It's right underneath all these big branches. And a lot of them look like they're getting ready to fall. And we're also underneath this uh, upper level storm trough that's going to produce strong winds and severe storms up to hurricane force winds and large hail for the next two days. So there's a lake. I'm going to backtrack to a lake. The wind's going to be helping me all the way there, so it's going to be pretty cool. 18 mile an hour winds today. And 20, 22 mile an hour winds sustained tomorrow. Yeah, it's going to be pretty crazy windy for a couple days. So I'm going to find a good spot out of the wind with electricity and hunker down. Yeah, and then we're going to ride. Ride like the wind, man. Back on course, back towards the Pacific coast, baby. Yeah, buddy. So we're going to go. I got Zena all loaded up. Someone head to the store. I have to get change. And probably a jug of Mountain Dew. I'm by bypassing coffee these last few mornings. If they have coffee, I'll get some, but yesterday it was gone already and she didn't seem like she wanted to make any more. Some young girl, like she was 16 or some shit. But yeah, it was pretty cool. So let's get rolling, man. Yeah, woo! Because they're saying uh, thunderstorm in an hour, or actually about a half hour. But I don't think they're right. I oh, hope not anyway. I could be sitting at the store waiting for it to pass by. <laughs> All right, see you later. Up to the store. Caffeine of some sort. So we're on our way to the lake. Yeah, almost there actually. Yeah man, I'm gonna go find a spot out of the wind, set up camp. And chill out. You check out the lake a little more in depth, you know. State Recreation Area. Yeah. Yeah, we came out here before. I didn't even look at all the other sites. I only looked at the primitive ones. They were all like in the wind. But I'm sure they have some other ones on other in uh, other areas out of the wind. 
are expensive ones. Stay out here for two days and head west. That upper level trough is supposed to move on in two days. The next two days is supposed to be windy. Today and tomorrow. Tomorrow worse than today. Possible hurricane force winds. Which is why we're moving. Because some branches right above my tent didn't look too good. So we're gonna find some place safe. This is a pretty nice area out here anyway. I'm glad I'm coming out here to camp. Oh wow, that mud hole dried up. That was a big huge puddle. Yesterday. Probably will be again today. Here is section C. I uh, we went through A and I didn't see any electric. I'm not seeing any electric here either. Too. So over the window to stay there cheaper. Save me ten bucks. Check out B down here. Hello. Nice day so far. <laughs> Hi boy. Hey, this looks pretty nice. Pretty out of the wind too. Wow, right on the lake. I just might have to take this spot. Wow. I'm like not having any wind at all right here. Interesting. Hmm. Said something about use it at your own risk. Is it flood right here? I bet it does, huh? I'll have to drive around a little more. <clears throat> so it's getting late. You know, it's obviously dark out. I'm in my tent eating a can of uh, beefaroni. Listening to the bullfrog. <clears throat> so, like I was saying right before my battery died, I'm eating some beef raviolis. Or no. What are they? <laughs> beef aroni. Yeah. You know, like the... <clears throat> like the ravioli noodles. Or... But anyways, listening to bullfrogs. Wait, tents really close to the water. Hmm. But if I make noise, they'll shut up. So I gotta be quiet. Get him here in a second. Mm. And there you go.
pretty cool, man. <laughs> yeah. To get going like a chorus. It's freaking cool, man. Wee! All right, we're all packed up here at the lake. Ready to rock. I had to wait for it to get done raining, so it's going to be kind of late start to the day, but that's all right because the wind's going to be helping me out. Yep. And if I, you know, it could just be a short day, like 30 miles to Gordon, or I could uh, go 60 miles to, I forget the name of that town, but yeah, so here we are, man. The bike is all loaded. I think this phone holder so adjustable. It's awesome. Yeah, much better than the last one I had. So yeah, load it up. Here's where my tent was. The only dry piece of ground. <laughs> one last look around, make sure I didn't leave anything laying on the ground anywhere. No pieces of garbage or anything like that. And it looks great. Yep, looks really good. This is a nice place to camp out. Yes, sir. What's the name of the lake? Uh, Cottonwood Lake? Or something? I don't know. All right. Let's get the show on the road. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching. Please hit that thumbs up button. Later.